Hi, welcome to Pitch Report. This is Beyond the Try Line with Bilroy Fernando. weekend we had a break last weekend where at the end of uh, the league competition before the uh, club knockout tournament there was a week's break for players and then it started off with a bit of a bad note where uh, Candice Vosla could be pulling out from the competition so the Sri Lanka rugby had to redraw do the competition draw format again and with the buy for the table leaders of the league uh, CRNFC so there were only uh, three quarter final games as against the scheduled four games Games with the Candy Sports Club pulling out. In the first game, we had on Police Sports Club taking on Air Force. That was the first quarter final game at London Place last week. At the halftime, it was 17 all, and uh, full time score was in favor of Police 29 points, so very close 29 points to Air Force 27. Air Force did give a good fight back. They, in fact, did very well in the first half toward Police, Francis Police Club, Sports Club 17 all, and eventually Police won the game. 20 29 points to 27 and in the second uh, quarter final game Ablox was Navy it was one title game Navy as you know uh, couldn't do well this season and they couldn't win a single game in the league and it was same in the knockout uh, quarter final and it was disappointing with Navy couldn't score do much and they only managed to score uh, five points in the entire game whereas uh, first half Ablox Sports Club got 29 points to Navy 5 and the full time score was 55 points to five in favor of uh, Havelock Sports Club who went through to their semi-final and in the third and the last quarter final CHNFC's army game was uh, it was very close in the first half it was CHNFC 15 to army 12 and army did uh, give a good fight back but the second half CH scored more tries with winning that match by 35 points to CH and army scoring 27 points We've also had the Savannah side, uh, Zahira College, uh, Centenary Rugby, Savannah Tournament over the weekend at the race course ground with the participation of 16 leading schools. Some of the teams from Candy did not take part, uh, St. Anthony's and Vidyata, but the uh, rest of the schools took part. And first day, some of the games were one sided with Pia. The, you could see the difference between some of the leading schools like St. Peter's, uh, Isipathana, DSN Nike, Wesley, uh, St. Joseph did really well. Royal College and Trinity College couldn't uh, keep up to the expected uh, levels. I was told that Royal didn't field the full swing team, but they'll be failing the full swing team against the, the competition organized by Sri Lanka Schools Rugby Football Association in two weeks from now, where the schools in, in schools knockout, uh, sorry, inter schools servants competition, uh, which will be happening in Colombo. So on day one, as expected, uh, clear the top two teams in each age group went through to the quarterfinal of the cup plate segment and the third place team for the goal and the last team for the shield. And uh, we saw very uh, closely contested game between St. Peter's versus this button. Uh, eventually St. Peter's won the game and they went on to win the finals also on day two where they met this button again in the cup final. So apart from these two schools, the West College and the SNI that did do well in the competition and so the cup final won by St. Peter's who beat Isipatra in the finals by 17 points to 5. So the cup finals, Isipatra College lost to St. Peter's. St. Peter did well to beat Isipatra by 17 points to 5 in the all important cup finals. The plate was won by Royal College who beat St. Joseph's by 24 points to 17 and the third place playoff was between Wesley and DSL. And DSL and was really a team that, in my opinion, did very well in the tournament as a school which started playing rugby after the St. Peter's is part of the Royal Trinity uh, schools of these top schools. And they did well to win the uh, third place playoff against Wesley by 12 points to 7. And the bowl competition won by Trinity College who beat uh, hometown school Kingswood College by 22 points to 5. And the Shield final was uh, won by a uh, school from Kurunagala, Malideva College, who beat Mahana by 7. 17 points to 12 and uh, that was a good crowd turnout at the stadium 
Uh, as you know, many of the schools uh, uh, do play in rugby tournaments, you get crowds in Sri Lanka and unfortunately the clubs we don't see that. It was a different thing when it came to the CRMX's is Candy, the second round league game at the London place where we had a huge crowd watching the, uh, the competition and we are hoping the crowds will start coming to club games like the school games. Uh, who knows uh, if someone starts an under 22 or 23 tournament, old boys or clubs, B teams even, you know, you will have the crowds coming back to watch rugby football which is uh, watched by most of the elite schools from Colombo, Candy and even uh, Goal and other areas. So it's interesting to see who's going to be winning the, uh, uh, the finals this weekend and I'll be bringing you more score updates next week and this is Dilroy Fernando signing off uh, Pitch Report. Thank you.